Your house has serious problems that endanger your health and your property manager? Nowhere to be found. That's the situation one woman finds herself in with Rathbun Realty, a company claiming $1.8 million in missing assets and a company under investigation by state officials. Not in your sides, Craig Smith is live at Rathbun Realty with the latest. Well, guys, if you look behind me here at this office, even with the sign removed, you can tell this is the office of Rathbun Realty. Now, tenants and landlords say the company is not taking their calls, but we found this place was not empty today. The ropes and the tarp on the roof are an attempt to fix what Kathleen Hogue says Rathbun Realty has it. Roof leaks serious enough to soak the wall and cause a mold bloom. Mold's bad for anyone, but especially bad for her. It certainly aggravates my breathing problems. I have a, a nebulizer machine that I've been having to use now since, I mean, I had to start using it this morning because I started coughing really bad. And, uh, you know, I can't afford to be in the hospital. She says Rathbun's failed to fix plenty of other trouble. She paid a lot of money on a lease before she heard the management company was claiming a worker embezzled $1.8 million. Now she says the company's not answering phone calls. When she went in person, the sign was removed and the window covered. We found the front shut down, but the back's pretty active. What happens to the tenants and landlords now? No comment. Could you identify yourself, sir? No comment. People peeked out the window, but no one picked up the phone. We got three no comments, two phone hangups, no answer on the door. Their communication is, is bad at best, and I'm getting the same information from my tenant. Um, and this is before they went into crisis mode. Oh, yeah, yeah. Landlord Dave Apcar says his troubles with Rathbun Realty started almost as soon as he hired them. Is it clear that you're going to get a payment when the rent is due? Uh, no, it isn't. <clears throat> I've talked to my tenant. They sent a check the 25th or 24th of August, and that check and maybe a previous check is owed to me. Plus, Rathbun has $1,650 of my tenant's uh, deposit money. Now, the company's sending letters to landlords saying it has lined up a different property management company to take over their accounts if they choose, but they're under no obligation to do that. Now, that same letter says... The company will likely file for bankruptcy and liquidate its assets so it can pay off some of its creditors, including landlords. Craig, is it possible for tenants to stop paying rent while this works itself out? Well, the, the usual advice we hear on any sort of landlord-tenant dispute is, no, you really do not want to stop paying your rent, no matter how ugly the dispute may be, because that gives them legal grounds to evict. All right, Craig. Thank you.